Hello, I'm Ramon Arancibia, Horticulture Specialist with the University of Missouri Extension. In this issue of the Commercial Horticulture Newsletter, we're going to talk about short period vegetable crops for fall or winter production under high tunnel. So the objectives are to describe the two main high tunnel management systems and list and describe some cold season vegetable crops suitable for fall winter production under high tunnels. The first system is the unheated tunnel and therefore it can get very cold in it. So hardy leafy vegetables such as spinach and chard are more suitable for this system. One or two layers of plastic film can be used. However, when two layers are used, the film must be separated between them. When using row covers or low tunnels, an additional protection can be expected. The other system is the minimally heated high tunnel. It is heated to maintain the minimum temperature just above freezing. Double film layers are used to reduce heat loss. In addition to other benefit, this system enhances growth and yield and shortens the time to harvest. A good resource for vegetable crops grown outside is the vegetable planting calendar. It provides information on seed needs and planting distance, but planting dates are not for high tunnel production. One of the most valuable crops for fall winter production are salad mixes or baby leaf salads. There are as many mixes as consumer preferences, so careful selection of the crop and variety is important. Seed mixes are available However, grow each crop separately to avoid adding individual problems to the mix, such as leaf size, bitterness, frost damage, etc. When growing leaf mixes, it's important the quality and the freshness, so wash, pack, and ship immediately after harvest. Lettuce and greens are among the most important crops for fall winter production under high tunnels. They're not hardy, so they're more appropriate for minimally heated high tunnels. They're mostly direct seeded in rows or broadcast. It takes 15 to 25 days for baby leaf salad, but 55 to 70 days for full head lettuce. The main lettuce types are leaf lettuce, which is used for baby leaf salads, and cos or romaine, iceberg and butterhead, which are harvested as full size heads. Lettuce. Spinach is among the most hardy crops for fall winter production of leafy greens. Therefore, they are more appropriate for unheated tunnels. There are two types of spinach, smooth and savoy depending on the uh, leaf characteristics. It takes 15 to 25 days for baby leaf salad, but 30 to 50 days for full size plant. Plant every week to extend the harvest into the winter. Swiss chard and kale are the three season crops because are grown in fall, winter, and spring. Chard is very hardy, but not all varieties of kales are hardy. Side raised with nitrogen to ensure continuous growth and harvest. Radish and turnips are also good crops to grow on the minimally heated high tunnel for fall and winter production. Can be planted in rows. It takes 25 to 30 days for radish and 40 and 50 days for turnips to reach harvestable size. Beets and carrots are also good crops for fall winter production and the minimally heated high tunnels. There are many types, red, white, yellow, striped. It's recommended to plant every two weeks to extend the harvest time into the winter. It takes 45 to 60 days, depending on temperature, to reach the harvest size. In the case of beets, it can be eaten just the roots as well as the tops as greens. Other crops suitable for fall winter production and the high tunnels are cilantro, parsley, leeks and scallions and chives. 
And this concludes this presentation, and I hope this information will be useful in your operation. Thank you.